And then uh, when I was writing the book, I got this, this, this overwhelming feeling again. And I was, I was looking at this whole area that we're just talking about. And what I got over and over, Akashic Records, Akashic Records, Akashic Records, look at the Akashic Records. Now, I came across the Akashic Records when, you know, like in 1991, when I was trying to understand what the hell was happening in my life. Um, but, but I didn't really look into it. And, you know, I just left it alone. And of course, it was popularized by Edgar Casey about the Akashic Records. So I started reading about the Akashic Records in, in more detail when I was writing the book and this was happening to me. Um, and I, I was reading, uh, actually on the Edgar Casey website, um, how it was uh, being described in computer terms, in database terms, that the Akashic Records is like a database that records um, everything, every conversation, everything that's ever happened, everything has an Akashic Record, et cetera, et cetera. And, and I looked at it and I thought, what they're calling the Akashic Records is the freaking database. <laughs> it's the database. So, the whole thing, this reality, this simulation, it's not people, you know, there's not, you know, non-human entities sitting there on a bloody piece of, of, of technology pressing buttons. It's run by AI. The very AI that's coming in, the very AI they want to connect to the human brain. Hello. And everything is recorded. Everything about a soul's, quote, incarnation is known because it's on the database. So if you, if you believe in a certain deity, when you leave the body, AI in your reality will produce the deity. So near death experiences say, uh, uh, a Christian will say, I saw Jesus. A Muslim might say, I saw Muhammad. And you see loved ones. And the loved ones, you, you read all these things that near death experiences talk about. You see loved ones and they, 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 they draw you into the light, the light tunnel. Now, what happens again and again, you, you, you read these accounts. They go through the tunnel. And they feel this bliss. Absolutely a doddle to simulate, uh, through frequency manipulation. I, I, I met a mind controller in America some years ago. And he said, I could get any two people to fall deeply in love with each other, even though in normal terms, they couldn't stand each other and would be repulsed by each other just by stimulating certain chemicals in the brain, which they do through frequencies. All right. So th this manipulation is absolutely possible. I hope you enjoyed today's segment. And here is a takeaway from today's video. In today's segment, David Icke said that what the system wants is complete control of human reality. They want to control everything we experience, the information we receive, and our reality by connecting our brains to AI. They want to take control of our interpretation of reality, to imprison us in a box of information that dictates our perception of reality. David Icke always say that we need to awaken from this trap. We need to come to the realization of the truth by questioning everything we hear. We need to process information before we can accept it so that we can come up with our own conclusion. I hope you enjoyed today's segment. Leave a comment in the comment section about what you think about today's video. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. See you in the next one.